to talk about this fantastic biography of Leonard Cohen, I'm Your Man. I've been a Leonard Cohen fan since my, whatever, he's 83 now, um, so he's older than me, but I've been a fan since I was really young. Indeed, my daughter's middle name is Suzanne, after the Tea and Or Oranges song, which had particular romantic associations for me way back in the day. This is a really good biography. It's a fantastic musical biography. Um, lots of discussions of his songs in very interesting detail. And my goodness, did he work on his songs, has worked on his songs for years. And one of the things that I love about Leonard Cohen, which comes over really strongly in this um, book, is he's got like a fine wine or a cheese. He's got better and better and riper and riper as he's got older. And some of his later work, like um, I'm Your Man, Tower of Song, his concert performances are just fantastic. The other strand, of course, is his spiritual life. He's a Jew by birth from a long line of rabbis, has this deep spiritual sense, been had a guru in India many years, a Hindu, very interested in Christianity, even dabbled very briefly in Scientology. And of course, as we all know, um, many years as a Buddhist, five years as a Buddhist monk, which was when, of course, all his money was ripped off by his manager. Anyway, I wouldn't say any more. I'm sure I've had two minutes, but it's an excellent book, very, very well written. And she had immense access, Sylvie Simmons, a musical journalist, to Leonard. So lots and lots of quotes from him as well. It's terrific. And if you don't know his music, read this book and then you'll want to.